Hey, 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 everybody, my name is Nightwolf, and welcome back to the Hatman Shadow Ward. So, been a little while. Uh, we played as the father path, I believe, in the last episode. So we're going to do the mother path this time. All right. We regret to inform you that your daughter, Virginia, has gone missing. That's eh, the same bullshit. Okay. So once again, uh... We kind of remember this. New search, search team, nobody's here. Uh, so, I presume this is going to be the exact same. Now, that's actually a really detailed painting. Oh, can't go in there. I have an epic lean. Okay, um... So, I know I'm supposed to play more horror games, but... I'm not good at a horror, man. Like, I don't know how some of you guys out there and other YouTubers could, uh... I don't know how you guys do it. Alright. Let's see. Oh, yeah. This releases the, uh... The freaky creature. Need something. So dark. So dark. It's already gotten hella spooky. Okay, got a page. What? Uh, we're already off to a good start. Okay. Get the pages, get the pages, get the pages, get the pages. Get the pages. I don't know where he, it is. Got it. Where are you? Got it. I think. I can hear, like, in my ears, very vaguely... Where he is. Oh. oh, there he is. Okay, hi. Okay, fuck you. Right past you. Hi, buddy. How are you? Hua! Fuck you, juked bitch. Okay. Um. Okay, you need to suck a dick. Um. I don't know where this last page is. But I don't want to keep juking him all day, because this is going to get annoying. Okay, can you, like, stop following me? That'd be splendid. Okay, fuck. Okay, don't touch. Bad touch. Remember, touching is bad, and I'm not allowing you to do so. Okay. I don't remember where that last sheet was. But you are really creepy. Um. Hi. You almost got me. You're really creepy, though. Not gonna lie. Alright. Um. Where is this last page? Do you know where the page is? Could you, like, tell me where the page is? Okay. Come over here. Put your hands down. At least that looks like you had your hands up. Oh, give. Alright, so now we got a flashlight. Which will help. Do you like the flashlight? No, you don't like the flashlight. Ha ha! I found your weakness, motherfucker. Did you go away? Okay, you went away. Um. But we can't stay still for very long. Um. Where is... Oh, I didn't even notice that wheelchair. Oh, I hear him. Fuck you. Open. Gone like a song. Okay. Now, I believe we get the axe down here. Slowly figuring this game out. Uh, okay. 
This game is really creepy. Now, I know in the last episode, which was quite a while ago, uh, I had mentioned <clears throat> that there is a... Uh, whoa. Oh, the special thanks room. Game mechanics. Game designers. That's actually quite a bit of game design. That's quite a bit of game designers. Um, now, I know... Oh, there it is. Um, I know there's not a lot to this game. Like, I know there, I know I wasn't really doing much in the last episode. And I said that I would check to see if there was anything more to this. And there actually isn't, but you guys did like it. So I'm actually going to play it again. Now, how do I, um, didn't I grab the axe? I swear to God, I grabbed the axe. What the fuck? Oh, there it is. I did grab it. Bam! Whack. Cool. Okay. So now... Uh, homework return, whatever. Okay. So now... This game gets awful. Not in regards to... Sprinting. <gasps> Fuck you. Uh, so, like, it doesn't get bad in regards to, um, being bad? Like, game-wise? But, um, it gets, like, scary. Now, I don't actually know if um, there's actually anything, like, super to this. Oh, fucking bathrooms. Like, I am in a sweat already. I'm pretty sure my body just went up, like, 80 degrees. Okay. You need to stop doing that. I guess this way. Fucking radio, shut up. What? 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 Sprinting. I don't care. I'm sprinting. Where are you? Once they, like, kind of get track on them, I think it'll be good. What's in here? There's nothing. There's nothing! <gasps> Fuck you. Hear whispering. I hear him. I hear him. I hear him. Where are you? I hear you. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Okay. I'm not going to lose track of you. Come here, ghoul face. Come on. Come here. Oh my god, you're spooky. Hi. Okay, so now we know where he is. This isn't real, okay? Glad to know that this isn't real. Hi. Um, Go straight, I guess. Come on. I know you like the kissy sounds. It's so hard to see with my flashlight flickering. Okay. Okay, he's still behind me. Stupid radio. I swear to God we're going in a circle. He's still behind me. Okay, he is. Oh my God, you're gaining speed. Uh, I presume that we need to collect... All the journal pages. I presume. That's my guess, anyway. Ah, there's one. GIF. Okay, so I think I'm figuring it out. I think. What? Where? 
<clears throat> I can't open any of these. I don't know why. I hear you. See, like, you can kind of hear the whispering. It sounds like a whisp, like that, and then you, it's kind of gives them away. And same with the flashlight. The flashlight definitely uh, helps you kind of figure out where he is. Like, if he's nearby or... Oh, fuck. He's near... Fuck it. Got it. Hell yeah. Got the final page. I hope. Journal. Um, I'm awake in bed, my neck sore from sleeping on one pillow. I asked for another, but I need a doctor's order to have more than one. My sleep medicine has worn off, and I'm once again a prisoner to my insomnia. I decided I might as well start writing things down like they asked. I'll get bonus points towards extra dessert, and something to do for now. I can hear the person in the next room snoring, people whispering, and the phone ringing at the nurse's station outside. I'm remembering the dream I had last night, where a tall man in a hat came to my bedside and told me he would take me away soon. I'm making a mental note to mention it to the doctor later. Right. Community group is over. I'm not sure who thought having insane people entertain each other was a good idea. Surprisingly, everybody was there today. Nobody killed themselves. That makes it a good day. Yeah. Somebody cried today, but somebody always cries. <laughs> Today's goal is to keep myself distracted and try not to think of new ways of killing myself. Yeah. I told them I'm past it. Been there, done that, I said. But they didn't think it was funny. Well, no. It's, it's still not funny. I remember something else about my dream. The man in the hat was wearing all black. Even his hat was black, and his skin was black. His eyes. I can't describe his eyes. It was like he had no eyes. Just empty sockets that seemed to be pulling on my soul. I remember being so happy when he said he would take me away from here. But now I'm afraid of where he might take me. Yeah. Process group with the social workers seemed like a huge waste of time. Everything we talked about after they said we were having sloppy joes for lunch seemed to have nothing to do with me. I tried bringing up my dream, but that just led to a discussion of more medication. As everyone was getting up to leave, Tanya walked me to the bookcase, reached behind it, and pulled out a book. She told me to read about the shadow people, and specifically someone referred to as the hat man. She said I would find my answer there. For recreational therapy, I read Tanya's book. It was a journal written by other patients about their encounters in the asylum with the shadow people. A couple had even seen the hat man just the way I did. I was still reading when they called lights out. Now, I don't claim to know much, but reading about a man who paralyzes people, chokes them, and steals their soul is not recommended reading for insomniacs just before bedtime. But now I know who I'm dealing with, even if it's only the meds creating him in my head. Okay. So that is all of it. <clears throat> so now we have a little bit of story about him. Now, I don't know who's writing the journal. I'm kind of curious to know who it is. Why the intense music, though? Because um, now I'm kind of curious. That music, though. Okay, I hear him. I don't know where he is, but I hear him. I feel like this is literally the exact same area. Oh, where? Where, 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 where? He sounds like he's behind me. Where? I hear him. I hear the heartbeat. Okay, I think he's... He's behind this wall. Oh my god. That's freaky. I kind of don't want to lose them now that I have them. But at the same time, it's like, you know. He's 
definitely on the other side of this wall. Bathroom. Another bathroom. Weirdly shaped bathroom. <gasps> Fuck. Oh no, I'm fucking screwed. Ah, oh, shit. Can you go through objects? I hope not. Oh no, I'm so boned. Are you done moving? Oh no, you're not. Hi. Hi, buddy. Okay, can you, uh. Okay. Ready? Whoop! And. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you're stuck. Come here. Oh, you are so close. Go! Ha <laughs> ha! Too fast for your floaty shit, bitch. Hi. It doesn't look like you even have a mouth either, which is super creepy. Um. Okay, I don't want to lose them because we have them. So now I know that it's safe to check rooms. Because he just kind of randomly appears places, right? So, oh, wait. This is the dead end, isn't it? Okay, no, there's another hallway. Where'd he go? Hat boy. Oh, I see your little mist that you're creating. Come on. Come on, we don't have all day. Whoop. Are you seriously going to be stuck? I'm scared of getting caught on the chair. Hi. Okay, we got him unstuck. Oh, it's dark in here without the thing on. Hi. Okay, we're going to go this way. Now, I don't know if we're actually going to find anything. But... Okay, are you still... Oh, fuck. Okay. Um, I'm kind of listening for him. Why is it every time I go into a fucking room, my light starts blinking? Stop it! Oh, I hear him. I hear your shit. I don't know if I'm walking right into him right now. Yeah, I am. Hi. Hi. So I don't even know if there's cheating death achievement. I don't know what I got. I don't know what I did to get that. But okay. Oh. Alright. Keep hearing whispers. Now I'm actually starting to think. Wait. This isn't real. I've seen this before. I'm going in a bloody circle. Bathroom. I don't trust those whispers. <gasps> Fucking wheelchair. Okay. I don't know if any of this is different. A lot of this looks the exact same. What? Oh, fuck me. You're beside me. I think you're behind me now. Alright. Um. Alright. I'm going to leave this episode here. Again, I thought it might be just the journal pages that we needed to get and that would be that but i can't really tell you so um yeah i think this is going to be the last episode of this this wasn't that bad of a game um spooky yeah very atmospheric um the boss is kind of easy to or the the enemy is kind of it's easy to get over him like uh he's not scary enough to keep you scared all the time um but like it's the atmosphere is very good on it i feel and i'm also bad with horror so um it doesn't take a lot to spook me but uh let me know if you guys play it let me know if you guys think it's good but with the big side guys i hope you guys the enjoyed the uh the mother side it's basically the exact side as uh exact same as the father side which i figured was going to be the case but you know whatever with that being said guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit that like button leave a comment down below check out my end screen stuff for some other stuff i have done for you guys and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more with that being said guys hope to catch you guys in the next video Bye bye